At first, you'd want to question if any dog breed can fight against wild animals. However, believe it or not, some dogs can put wild animals down. In fact, past encounters between the pair have taught some wild animals to steer clear of these dog breeds. In the past, attempts were made to breed dogs with traits such as intelligence, strength, speed, and a keen sense of smell to help herd sheep and keep flocks away from predators. The result? Breeds of dogs that evolved to do more than just that. I'm talking about dogs that have been bred to hunt and guard against wild animals, assist in police and military work, and on other days make your heart melt with their silly acts. What dog breeds could these be? Stick around to find out. Hello and welcome to another episode of Forever Green. And if you happen to have a dog breed listed as our number one, you've not only got yourself a dog that could match the lion for size, but for power. Let's dive in. Hey, get away. Twenty, Kangal. We start off today's video with a dog that isn't scared of anything, really. Few dog breeds in the world can be regarded as the ultimate guard dogs. Dogs that have no problem taking on any wild animal, and when I say any, I mean any. And the Kangal is one of such dog breeds. They possess immense size, strength, and tenacity to kill a wolf to protect their flock or owner. They're dogs that have a history that goes way back. Possessing a launching force of a Ferrari and one of the highest bite forces known to any dog breed, these guys can take on any wild animal with ease. Kangal vs. Wolf? Bring it on. Kangal vs. Snakes? Piece of cake. How about taking on a grizzly? Anytime. These guys are totally fearless and would do anything to keep wild animals away. Their intimidating appearance is warning enough for any intending assailant. Nineteen, Bagyari Cutter. The Bagyari Cutter dog looks like the German Shepherd at first glance. But these dogs that originated from Pakistan are arguably better guard dogs than their western counterparts. They are bad business for any wild animal that looks at prey or any livestock they guard. <laughs> the Bagyari Cutter is believed to have been a result of a crossbreed between a wild Pakistan wolf and a domestic dog. Hence the name Bagyari Kutta, with Bagyari meaning wolf and Kutta translating to dog. These dogs are definitely doing their wolf ancestors proud by showing the strength and courage the wolves have shown over the years. These dogs have suffered some undue criticisms in the past and are regarded as one of the most underrated breeds in the world. Nonetheless, these dogs are being trained to be excellent guard or shepherd dogs and are so good at their jobs, many prefer to call them the Pakistani Shepherd Dog. I prefer to call them PSD for short. With these dogs standing guard, you could visit the grocery store and be rest assured that they would see to it that your livestock doesn't go astray or be attacked by any predator. 18. Caucasian Shepherd if you ever find yourself in cold, snowy woods, one companion you should take with you is the Caucasian Shepherd Dog. Not only are they well adapted for such harsh weather conditions, but they can also be your savior when wolves try to attack you. <laughs> These big fluffy booties aren't all cute and cuddly, as they would do whatever it takes to protect their owners, even if it means attacking a wolf. They are fierce protectors, just as they are friendly playmates when appropriately trained. 19. This breed has successfully chased away grizzlies and wolves for centuries. There was a time this dog wasn't at hand to foil the wolf attack, which eventually led to the loss of some sheep. The Caucasian Shepherd got back and furiously went after the wolf that had done this to give him a taste of his own medicine. That should teach him. 17. Rhodesian Ridgeback 
the African Lion Hound, as they are often called, didn't earn that name for any wild animal to attack their owners or livestock. These strong-willed and confident hunting dogs are way better than your everyday guard dog. They are as fast as an athlete and very smart. This means you don't have to wait for your command to snuff out any threat. Their incredible speed, which comes from their awesomely athletic body, enables them to approach wild animals from afar or chase them as far as possible. More so, they are aggressive types of dogs with strong personalities. Their combination of strength, excellent scent tracking ability, courage, and agility makes them capable of taking down and tracking wild animals. 16. Bloodhound When it comes to hunting with a keen sense of scent, bloodhounds are right up there with the best. In the past, bloodhounds were bred to track wild boar, deer, and even people. Nowadays, their talents are being employed in the military and police work. While it could be said that bloodhounds are the fiercest dog breed out there, their incredible sense of smell could detect a wild animal from a distance away and alert its owners of any impending danger. This is one dog that will alert if you are in any form of trouble, more like an alarm system to guard against danger. And to top it all off, their strong tracking instinct can come in handy if you decide to go after any wild animal. 15. Commodore With a coat that looks a lot like that of a sheep, these pups could patiently wait in ambush for any wolf to try attacking the flock. Commodore are ancient guard dogs that have been trusted for centuries to keep livestock and homes safe. They may look like walking mop sticks, but they aren't some ragdoll or cuddly bunny any predator can take on, except for maybe a polar bear. They would guard against any wild animal or intruder. Check out the size of this guy. He's not letting any sheep get away. These agile, intelligent, and highly spirited dogs won't let any predator get past them. If you think these dogs are brave, our number one pick will surely blow your mind. 14. Bull Terrier what do you get when you cross a bulldog with a terrier? You get a breed that has the dexterity and speed of the terrier with the fierce tenacity of the bulldog. These fearless dogs can take on anything from wild boars to even tigers. Look at him go. They're strong, responsive, intelligent, alert, energetic, and aggressive towards any threat. These daredevil dogs may not be the biggest dog breeds in the world, but their unwavering bravery means they can take on animals several times their size. A bull terrier will put his life on the line to safeguard his owner's life and property. They, along with the Gultaheer and the Bully Cutter of Pakistan, are some of the bravest dog breeds around. 13. Alibi Dog Three words that come to mind when the alibi dog is mentioned are strong, independent, and loyal. Also known as the Central Asian Shepherd Dogs, which originated from Central Asia, are the oldest existing dog breed. They are shepherd dogs, watchdogs, and dog fighters, all wrapped into one. <laughs> they are called Voldakov, which means wolf crusher for their immense strength and natural tenacity to guard against wolves or predators. In fact, the Russian president Vladimir Putin once had an alibi dog to show how trusted these dog breeds are in safeguarding life and property. In a 1v1 battle with a wolf, they would comfortably defeat the wolf, matching them for size and strength. They would die protecting their owners against wild animals. Bully Cutter As the name hints on, this dog breed is one hell of a bully, tearing down anything that stands in the way of the safety of his owner or livestock they watch over. There's been quite a debate as to how this breed came to be, with some sources claiming that they were first bred in India. In contrast, others believe they originated from Pakistan, and the latter being the truer of both theories. Currently, they are mostly found in Pakistan where they take safeguarding their owners very seriously. 
I know I might have said that the bully in Bully Cutter shows how much of a bully these dogs are, but actually, their name is gotten from the word bully, which means heavily wrinkled. As they are sometimes called, the Beast of the East are strong, aggressive dogs that are bred for hunting and fighting. Eleven, Belgian Malinois. Being a dog breed predominantly used as a working dog in the military and police, the Belgian Malinois is one dog breed that would definitely tear into any wild animal that tries to attack its owner or livestock. These brilliant, active and versatile dogs are capable of carrying out some high-level actions. And it could all be on their own. Malis can be used for a couple of things apart from just a guard dog. You could train your Mali to perform search and rescue, sniffing detection work, personal protection, and as a family pet. While some other dogs may be scared to attack a wild animal, the Belgian Malinois wastes no time in taking the beast down. Track men! Track men! Track men! Watch! Track men! Before we check out the next 10 dog breeds, kindly smash that like button if you've enjoyed the video so far. You should also hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell for more awesome content. 10. German Shepherd There are a couple of things this breed has in common with the likes of the Belgian Malinois and the Bagyari Cutter. Build, appearance, certain traits and no doubt the same zero tolerance for any assailant, wild animals or humans. German Shepherd dogs were first bred primarily to be guard dogs. Because they are fearless and self-confident, they will assertively stand their ground and fight off any threat. Take for instance, this little Spitz was attacked by a coyote. But luckily, his German Shepherd friend swoops in and attacks the coyote from behind. They can as well as beat up wolves like some ragdoll. Nine. Great Pyrenees When this bear decided to have some mutton for lunch, he had no idea they were under the protection of a Great Pyrenees. The Great Pyrenees shows up and tells the bear to look elsewhere for its lunch. These guys are famed for their enormous size and ferocity while on guard. They've been a protector of the flock from wolves and bears from way back. Nothing scares them when it comes to ensuring the safety of the flock or their owners. They are powerful, alert, strong, beautifully graceful dogs that have the right mix of calmness and ferocity. Sometimes they even make sure no intruder leaves until you get back home or the guys from animal control. Coyote, I just want to go home. I promise you'll never see me again. Great Pyrenees, the only place you're going is behind bars, you thieving punk. Eight, Bull Arab. If you ever need to go wild boar hunting, the one dog you should have with you is the Arab Bull. They were developed in the 1970s by crossing a couple of dog breeds such as the Bull Terriers, German Shorthaired Pointer and the Greyhound. Their sole purpose was to do the heavy lifting involved in wild pig hunting by chasing down the pigs and pinning them by the ear. They are large and muscular dogs in addition to this, they make for good watchdogs and would alert you when they sense something is off. Seven, Rottweiler. A born guard dog, these guys have enjoyed successes in the police, military, doing some personal work and being the family protector. Roddies are alert, highly intelligent and come off as fearless creatures. They have strong, powerful jaws that were primarily used for hunting wild boars. Rodwellers are also confident, loving, loyal and can defend their owner against wild animals if needed. No one or animal can come dangerously close to its family. 
and when this coyote got too close to its territory, he was soon sent packing. They have the tenacity to be quick and full of energy. Taking on a wild animal would be easy. Six, Pitbull. How many dog breeds do you know that can stand up to a tiger like this? Apparently this pitbull can, albeit the tiger being locked in a cage. The pitbull was fearlessly challenging to a duel. Pitbulls are known for such bravery, and this is why they are one breed wild animals don't want to cross. They have a history of baiting bulls by biting and dragging them about the head. Such bad reputations still precede these dogs, as many are scared to have an encounter with one. Very muscularly built, brave, loyal, powerful, independent and relentless, a pit bull never backs down from a fight. Especially when it has to do with safeguarding his owner. They're not much of a shepherd dog though, so I wouldn't suggest charging them with keeping your livestock safe. Boa Bowl. Next, we've got a breed from South Africa that was bred to keep the homestead safe from leopards, hyenas, lions and all manners of wild animals, as well as working the farm. They were even used in dog fights. These large muscular dogs are confident, quiet, courageous and extremely protective. Boa Bowls are a member of the Mastiff family with dog tails and one with the most agility. Well, they also don't like to have black bears around. In all, when you own one of these pooches, you can totally depend on it to defend you if you encounter a wild animal. Four, Cane Corso. Over in Italy, the protector in chief is the Cane Corso. This Italian Mastiff breed serves as a personal protector, tracker, law enforcement agent and guard dog. They are well muscled and less muscular than their cousins, the Neapolitan Mastiff, and every other Mastiff breed. Cane Corso boasts of tremendous strength, alertness, intelligence and a majestic appearance. Kill it! Kill it! Hey! Kill it! These guard-come-hunting dogs always take their guarding duties very seriously. Always on the lookout for the first sign of trouble, you'll find them barking as soon as they notice something's off. For a dog breed to hunt wild boar, they fiercely guard their families and will most definitely protect you against wild animals and stay there till their last breath. 3. Bakawal Dog This is a lovely and ancient breed of dog of Indian origin. The Bakawal Dog is a working dog found across the Pir Panjal range of India, Afghanistan and Pakistan. It was first bred by the Bakawal and Gujar nomadic tribes to serve as a guardian dog and settlement protector. Nowadays, it is used by the Indian police service to catch militants across the country. Bakawal dogs are believed to have descended from the cross of the Tibetan Mastiff and the Indian Pariah dog. You could see the resemblance, right? Their stellar work ethic has made it hard for wild animals to attack the livestock they protect and militants that want to attack villages. This has led to them being victims of attacks from wild animals and even the militants. <laughs> 2. Dogo Argentino Dogo Argentino is a huge muscular type of dog breed with one hell of a bite force. They are bred to hunt big games like puma, wild boar and the likes. They are often regarded as pack hunting dogs. Therefore, they could work as a group to hunt their prey together with other members of their species. On their own, a Dogo Argentino can take on a black bear, wild boar, cougar, leopard, puma and the likes. 
they show tremendous strength, intelligence, and are swift to act. Because they are hunting animals, they have a powerful and excellent lung capacity and never tire out easily. 1. Tibetan Mastiff How could we make a list of dog breeds that could defeat wild animals without including this top dog? They can weigh between 45 and 72 kilograms and reach heights of around 0.83 meters. That's just a few centimeters shy of the average height of a lion. Pretty impressive, huh? They have quite a majestic mane themselves, the Guardians of Tibet. As I would like to call them, are strong, resilient, intelligent guardian dogs that are believed to take down any animal, even a tiger. Their powerful jaw strength and massive size are added advantages to this breed. Coupled with their ability to withstand the harshest weather conditions, these guys are quite a formidable opponent for any assailant. 1. How many dog breeds do you think can win a food competition with wolves and win? We've come to the end of another awesome time here and were to pick only three dog breeds in this video to make your ultimate protector dog team, which ones are you choosing? Let us know in the comment below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. See you around.